Check out the fancy drawbridge. Uh, typical. Subtle Tony. After you. Oh! Are you okay? Uh, I'm fine. So Tony Stark, the Tony Stark lives here? I fear so. Tony? Hey, Bruce. Long night? Ooh, long five years. <laughs> um, at least it's quiet. Yeah. It was. I... <clears throat> hey, back off! Hi, I'm sorry. Who are you? Uh, Kamala? Well, uh, Kamala, your Emeraldite friend here is kind of on my shit list. Okay. I deserve it. Yeah, you're damn right you deserved it. Do the Avengers pose a danger to society? That was the question, Bruce. That was the question. Did you even check the science? Did you check it was a heist, science? Bruce. No. We were outsmarted. No. The Terrigen reactor was unstable, <sighs> and you knew that, you knew that, and you still paraded it before the entire world. So what? We just give up? We didn't give up, Tony. We failed. At least I can admit that. No. No, we failed him. We failed him. Tony, I don't know how long you're gonna be mad at me, and to be honest with you, I don't really care. Take as long as you want. But, but the kid is inhuman. We did this. And she needs your help. I, I can't, I can't. You can't what, you're ditching me? Hey, don't take it personally, kid. No, this is what he does, isn't it? And why don't you take a good look around, huh? I can barely help myself. <laughs> this was a mistake. Now we agree on something. So you're both just gonna walk away? The Avengers were set up. Cap was murdered. You think I don't know that? Huh? I've replayed that day in my head a thousand times. The Avengers take the ball despite saving the day, and that bastard Tarleton walks away smelling like a rose. And guess what? Guess what? No one cares. No one cares. The world needed someone to blame, and he gave them their scapegoat. So, unless you have some kind of astounding proof. I suggest you both get off my land. What is that? Proof. This better be good. Hmm. Kind of buried the lead, you know. Could have told me about that earlier. No, no, no. No sitting on my couch. You're still on the list. Where did you get this? Guess your password on some resistance blog. Impressive. Dude, your password was I am Iron Man. Really? Huh. Thought I'd change that. Son of a bitch. I know, it's incomplete. There's a whole folder on AIM's server. No, no, there's there's more here. What? Yeah, look at smart. They encrypted it to look like a corrupt file. Need a few hours, I'll get all the rest. What is this? Who is, who is Tiny Dancer? Oh no. We gotta get out of here. What? You know this shameless Elton John fan? They helped me get out of Jersey. I wouldn't be here if they hadn't warned me about AIM. Really? Tiny Dancer? Look, we really should go. Now. I would have gone with Rocket Man.
Okay. I gotta get dressed. You have a suit? Yeah. Maybe, sorta. Of. We'll see. Let's get airborne. Party crew. Good thing I don't have neighbors. They'd be so pissed off right now. You always love to make an entrance, Stark. How did I do? Uh, I'll give you a 7 out of 10. Good to see you, Georgie boy. Been working out? Any any other billion dollar companies lately? Just yours. Hey! You're gonna pay for that window, Tarleton! This is your new place? I... You need to listen to logic and reason. Why start now? Wait! No! Stuff was in there! How are you feeling? I've never felt better. Your synthetics were useless. If you'd let me deal with the Hulk and Khan earlier, the Archive would still be standing. Watch your words. You no longer make the rules. He does. When I was young, I found an orphaned wolf cub in the forest behind our farm. What? Dad said it was too dangerous. He told me to get rid of it. I fed that cub. I named him. I watched him play with my beloved dog, Darwin. You're wasting my time. I felt if I could instill rules, the proper boundaries, I could harness the raw power of that beast. I'm done rambling! Oh, oh. A few months later, while hunting, the adolescent cub turned on me, snarling, frothing at the mouth. Darwin bought me a few precious moments to call for help. My dad shot the wolf, but it was too late. Darwin had been torn to pieces. We need him. <laughs> I I'm sorry. I don't know what came over me. Leave. Please. Jarvis! You haven't aged a day. Welcome back, Mr. Stark. Missed you, buddy. You flying free? In full working order. Give me the worst of it. The Chimera is running on secondary power. Major hull damage is also detected. Engines are offline. Climate... So it's bad. That is an accurate assessment. Okay, we gotta get this bird airborne. <laughs> Excuse me? AIM knows it's here. So it needs to not be here when they get here. What? All right. While we work on cleanup, you mind taking a look at something for me? Certainly, sir. See what you can do about decrypting this file. At once. Whoa. <gasps> hey! Sorry? You should have knocked. I was trying. I uh, was knocking fist. Jarvis, help me out here. It appears the locking mechanisms on some of the Chimera's crew quarters have not been enabled. There you have it. I will fix that. Please do. I'm gonna meet up on the command deck in about ten minutes. You should, uh, should come. I know, I... I look ridiculous. <laughs> yeah. Of course you do. Man... No, 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 no. We all do. It's part of the job. Have you seen Thor's outfit? Flowing robe? Vegas shoulder pads? I mean, pretty ridiculous. <laughs> I am digging this, uh... Oh, it's a burkini. My mom bought it for me. Muslim ladies like to wear it for sports and stuff. It's great. Uh, all right, I'm just gonna change. Wait, 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 wait. The outfit is, is all about attitude. 
got to wear it like you mean it. Show me what you got. Come on, you can do better than that. Yeah, now we're talking? All right. You know what? Maybe I can help you with some upgrades for that. Gear's already spinning. Really? Yeah. Oh, and if Bruce says anything, just remind him that all he wears are super stretchy shorts. <laughs> Where the hell is my dropship? Scanning. The dropship was moved to a more secure location ahead. We can't get there before it takes off. We can if we overcharge the suit by 300% and take the direct route. Sir, you might literally explode, and that canyon is treacherous. Sure, but I feel the need for speed. Do it, Goose, and play something fast. Yes, sir. I've scanned the dropship and it contains the needed parts to repair the Chimera's fabrication machine. Excellent. Let's check in on the kids and head home. Well, that was fun. Gotta say, it's nice to be back in the saddle. Yes, sir. You haven't missed a beat. Ah, glad to see that flattery upgrade kicked in. Now, let's take a peek at our loot. Ah, we hit the jackpot, buddy. This is exactly what I need to fix the fabrication machine. Glad to hear it. Especially as your current suit is now, how would you put it? Kaput. Hey, hey, did the job, right? All right, that is more like it. Don't it look amazing, Jarvis? Take my picture. Well done, sir. All right, guys, we've got work to do. Hi, suit. Touche. How can we help? Jarvis has found a couple heat signatures that might be concentrations of initiator cores, but they're in completely separate locations. Since time is of the essence, we're going to need to hit both locations simultaneously. Bruce, you and Kamala need to search the outskirts of the Badlands while I investigate a city on the eastern seaboard. Hopefully, one of these spots yield us those initiator cores. You got it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where is everyone? Seems AIM has evacuated the city due to heavy inhuman activity. Sounds like an excuse to experiment on dangerous technology. Maybe your heat signature hunch was right. A giant stash of initiator cores could power their experiments. The facility is heavily guarded. Expect resistance upon... Oh, no. Not good, not good at all. This is my arc reactor technology, but supersized. This could level cities. What is AIM thinking? Oh, hello there, handsome. Congratulations, sir. You've successfully destroyed the arc reactor. Well, that's not something I ever expected to hear you say. Let's salvage what we can and get out of here. Are you all right? Yeah. Yeah, just, you know, I made it for all the right reasons. That's what I told myself. But look at what happened. The Terrigen reactor, A-Day. Now this. I can't control what other people do with my tech, but I can't pretend it's out of my hands anymore. I'm proud of you, sir. Yeah. I'm proud of me, too. Speaking of trouble, Bruce, Kamala, any luck with those initiator cores? Uh, working on it. Okay, kids, counting on you finding this second heat signature. Hopefully it yields us a bounty of initiator cores. It won't be long till AIM pinpoints the location of the Chimera, and without a base of operations, yeah, well, we won't have much of a chance. So, don't let me down. And good luck. <sighs> We have scavenged every part of this desert by now. It's not gonna be enough. <sighs> Am I alone? What? Where are all the other Inhumans? Why aren't they fighting back? I... I... If 
seen the resistance symbols. I've heard rumors of a rebellion, but still nothing. I don't feel sick at all. I've never felt more alive. What if I'm wrong? I know what that feels like. These powers are a part of us. And all I do know, it's a lot better if you just embrace that. Something like that. <sighs> My dad used to say the same thing. No, well, he's a more guy. <laughs> the best. You should head back to the Chimera. Okay. Stay where you are. Come. Kid and an old guy. Old guy. Alright. Dr. Pym will see you now. Do H Hank Pym? Hank? Bruce? What are you doing out here? I could ask you the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's good to see you, man. Good to see you. Uh, Kamala, this is... Dr. Hank Pym. Ant-Man? That was, uh, another life. Follow me. Okay, so this is the heat signature we've been searching for. We have been salvaging weapons, robots, aim tech, anything we can to build up our defenses. Think you could spare some of these initiator cores? You know, help out a helicarrier in need of some TLC? I imagine we can make some arrangements. Thank you very much. What <laughs> is this place? We call it the Ant Hill. Oh. Not my idea. I think it was one of our anonymous hackers, Tiny Dancer. No way. So, so they're all... Inhumans, yes. Many of them were prisoners at a name facility. I guess they were fighting back after all. Make yourself at home. We've got lots to catch up on. Okay, now that we've got some muscle on our side, I think we should hit one of Ames' testing labs. We know they've been experimenting on inhumans in small rural communities. I'd like to get my hands on whatever research they've been collecting. Sounds good. We crashed one of their big labs in the Pacific Northwest. Olympia Archive? Impressive. We wondered who was responsible for taking that place down. Thanks. We didn't get out with a lot of information, but now maybe we can find out more. Welcome to Venture Ridge, Wyoming. This was one of Ames' go-to holding sites for inhumans before the prison was built. After they moved in, most of the residents were evacuated. Got it. Keep an eye out for AIM patrols. They won't take kindly to your presence. With any luck, we'll be able to capture intel that could shed some light on what they've been doing to your... Reached Ames network. They're hiding something. Stand by and see to the Aim forces. Oh, they'll get seen. Hey, are you okay? Fine. Oh, 
cool powers. I mean, they look awesome. Um, I'm a polymorph, I think. It's cool, it's like, like stretchy arms and stuff. Uh, still working on making it not look goofy, but... You're inhuman. Yeah. So what's your name? Dante. Kamala. Hey, what happened? I broke my leg during the escape. Well, at least you made it out, right? My mom came back for me. Yeah, I made it out. And she was captured. Well, the Avengers are on the way here in a couple of days, okay? They're gonna take back the prison and your mom's gonna be fine, believe A couple believe days? Me. Why isn't anyone listening to me? I overheard Dr. Pym. They're moving all the prisoners to a new location. Well, Ugh. they'll find that too. Oh, no, they won't. Your Avengers will be too late. Here, let me help you. No. Don't you get it? We're inhuman. No one cares about us. That's not true. I've got to tell Bruce. We could do something. I've got to convince Bruce and Dr. Pym to go back to the prison. Roy, I need you to send one of your disposable chassis to the Camaro with a few supplies. And Roy, stealth will be key. Right away, Doctor. I'm going to say it. It's, it's just genius. Hey, got a sec? Yeah, 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 what's up? AIM's moving the Inhumans to a more secure location. Soon. Okay. You've been talking to Dante? Uh, I'm sorry, who, who's Dante? One of our Inhuman survivors. We were able to get him out, but his mother is still inside. And our escape caused AIM to shore up security. Gotcha. Look, we have to help them. That's not a good idea. What? There's inhumans in there. I don't understand. Dante's we, mom. We I can't just know, sit know, around and do nothing. We're not going to sit around and do nothing, okay? Roy just left with the energy cores. It means Tony's going to be here in less than a day. We need to wait. I don't understand. We have the Hulk. Kamala, the Resistance has been trying to infiltrate that facility for months. Getting out was far easier than getting in, and we, we had help. From the ground, its walls are nearly impenetrable. You saw what we did back there. I could help. But it's too risky. You want to help? You don't There's understand. You're not inhuman. You're not ready. I'm sorry. We wait. Not again. Not again. Not again.